everyone, I'm Kathy Lee with BK Forex. Today, I want to talk about my what the fuck, what the F trade, excuse my French. Over the past year, I've made more than 3,700 pips for our BK members with my what the F strategy. More than 1,200 pips in the past nine weeks alone as stocks are melting down. Timing is very important when it comes to trading. Knowing when to trade and knowing when not to trade can make the difference between a winning and a losing day. I trade only at the Asia and New York Open because these are what the, where the, we have the what the F moments. That means I look for setups at 8 p.m. New York time, which is 8 a.m. in Singapore, Hong Kong, 9 a.m. in Tokyo, and 10 a.m. in Sydney. About half of these trades hit my profit target before I go to bed three hours later, and the rest of the time I carry the positions overnight. For my New York Open trades, I look for setups around 6.30 a.m. New York time, which is 11.30 a.m. in London, 6.30 p.m. in Singapore, Hong Kong, 7.30 in Tokyo, and 8.30 in Sydney p.m. 90% of these trades are closed before they ring the U.S. equity market open bells. These are the what the F moments when Asia traders wake up, review what happened in the New York session and think, what the F? Should I buy after the Fed hike or sell? I should buy after the Fed hike or sell after the weak jobs number. The same is true for the New York Open and much more so because a lot happens overnight in the Asia and European session, like Bank of Japan intervention this week. US traders wake up, they think, what the F? And hit the sell button. That's exactly what we did this week. On Thursday at the New York Open, we sold Swiss Yen and Dollar Yen, riding the intervention two hours before on the premise that North American traders would wake up and go, what the F? And hit the sell button right away. Swiss Yen was the best trade because the market was unimpressed by the Swiss National Bank rate hike. But this Dollar Yen trade was just as beautiful. Knowing the significance, of what would be the first intervention by the Japanese since 2011. I put, I put our members into short yen crosses numerous times this past few weeks. We sold CAD yen, as you see here. We sold Aussie yen here. And this week we sold Kiwi yen and CAD yen again the night before the Bank of Japan came into the markets. We added another 100 pips to our tally this week because of intervention, because of the zip, but most importantly, because we understand that U.S. traders wake up, assess what happened overnight, and hit the sell button right away. My strategy is the what the F trade, because that's the momentum we ride at the New York and Asia opens. And that's why we trade at the time we trade. It's nice to win, but it is even more important to understand why we win. Events like the Bank of Japan intervention happen once in a decade, but we trade zip every day and these what the f moments large and small happen all the time and that's how we managed to make money 17 out of the last 18 weeks banking 3700 pips in the last 12 months with only one minor losing month in march of 60 pips so if you're interested in learning my zip strategy and getting my forex trades there's a special discount link at the bottom of this video and don't forget to subscribe to my channel bk forex it's the only real one